Hello everybody, this is Kevin with Inspiring How You See That. We're the inspirational channel that goes behind the scenes, interviews some of your favorite artists, entertainers, and much more. So we're back with a Tech Tuesday talking again about OBS. Um, we've done several segments and of course be watching out for up and coming segments. So make sure you do like and subscribe so that way you can get notifications when we're putting out anything about OBS, whatever it may be, or Brian and I are putting out there. Um, we not only do the helpful segments, but we also do the music, entertainment, and much more behind the scenes. So we're talking about OBS within the mic system. We had uh, talked and said that we were going to be giving you guys a little bit of uh, information here about uh, some of your microphones that you're using and some of the settings. And now these are just quick, you know, overview segments within OBS and, you, you know, utilizing your microphone and they're not going to go real in depth. Um, even within this segment, if there's a part that you want to get to quickly, of course, just fast forward it. Okay, so we're here in OBS. And as you see, we already have just our back uh, display picture, but we already have our microphone over here. And I wanted to, you know, show you the mic and how some of the settings can work. And if you just double click on that and you go to your default mic, which our default mic right now is the Yeti Classic. So if you want to go into your Yeti, make sure that is set up there underneath the microphone. You then can go down here and you see where we're talking here. You can see the microphone's picking up the sound and it's working properly. Now, one thing that you guys want to keep in mind is you see how this little area here goes into the red. You don't want this going into the red all the time or it gets really distorted and really bad. So that's one helpful tip. As we say, you know, make sure in the comments below that you put something you're having hangups on because we're not gonna cover every little detail in every one of these, you know, helpful tip videos. So if there's a specific area that you may be hung up on, let us know, be watching out for those future videos. We'll try to get them out as quick as we can and put that segment out there. So we'll go into the little gearbox uh, settings here and you'll click filters. So these are your, these are some of the filters that we have set up and we find that works best you know your noise suppression compressor gain now the good thing is most of these when you go in especially with a yeti or you know that style of microphone they're already set up for you and they actually work pretty well so really we could go through a lot of these settings and tell you hey let's set it at 4.10 you know and your setup might sound totally different so you kind of got to you know, I would say move these around, listen to your recording after it's done. Do a lot of tests because everybody's computer and everybody's sound system picks up differently. So I can't tell you, set this one at 4.10. And, you know, we've saw other videos out there where they do, you know, tell you to set them at certain levels. And, and they do, you know, don't get me wrong, they do help out and they're close. But if you really want crisp sound or if you're still getting a little bit of distortion or background or picking up maybe somebody that's you know doing you know construction work by wherever you're shooting a video um you know if you go into your noise suppression you can go under you know higher lower usage and you know there's a lot of settings within there so you just got to kind of tinker with it now as you see if you right click on it you can you can set up a bunch more so there, there's limiters, noise gate. So let's say if we wanted the noise gate in there, we just click OK. And you see there's different settings here. And most of those, especially, as I said, for Yeti, they're pretty close to where you need to you know, have them set. So if you're using a different microphone, again, you're going to have to kind of go through, test it, see what works best for your, your sound settings. So these are some of the, the you know, some of the, the microphone settings that we just kind of wanted to give you a quick overview and do this video. So that way you can see where to, you know, put these filters and these settings. And as we get into, you know, more videos, you can let us know where your problem lies. If it's a echo or if it's a, you know, I don't know, you picking up some sound from somewhere else or a even you know noise feed i mean there, there's so many different things that may be picked up and there's all different settings for those so we can go through and help that 
So this one I just, you know, added here if you want to just click, you know, remove. So I'm going to, I'm going to remove that. So these are segments that we produce from comments and emails that you guys have sent us. So we hope these little short segments help you and keep those comments flowing. And we'll keep the videos flowing to whatever we can put out there and produce for you guys to, you know, help you out. So we hope this segment helps and we'll see you on the next one.